There is a dead dog in this one. The tenants gone in the middle of the night, just their mess in this little metal tinderbox in tall grass in cornfield forest. Your stomach kicks and you lurch out into the fresh air. The trailer park sweats around you. The trailer park is a landfill that hasn't blown out its knee yet. The kids run through the alleys between the mobile homes, laughing barefoot in broken glass and rusted lawnmower blades. It is the only time they ever smile. Maybe we all suffer from precognition. There is a trailer, a screen door calling to you, the stench of hot bloated death beckoning you back in, green smoke arms shimmering in the summer heat. You have to go back in sometime. You drag the exacto blade in a large square, crawling backwards across the floor, one long desperate exhale. You fold the seizing sensation in your gut into a crumple of carpet, drag the smell of sour meat out. As you start to load the truck, you wonder what her name was. She has still got her collar on. As you peel layers of dead skin out of every room, the gaping wound in plumbing, the linoleum cracked sewage dripping through jagged pressboard teeth, soaking into the insulation, something sticky and black smears the kitchen, the bowels of a foam couch spatter, a sacrifice of plastic toys, all the wheels broken off. This is what it looks like to pray for a structure fire. This could all be yours, you tell yourself. This endless procession of unapologetic filth, not the people, but the wailing tragedy they leave behind, mountain after mountain of rotten, bleeding, unwashed crap until you cannot remember the hundreds who pay their rent, pack up, and whistle on off down the road. It is just the hammer swinging at the knuckles over and over again. They puke their apologies into your voicemail. They blow lead shot through the roof. They fill a whole room with garbage bags full of bandages. They break every window with a broom handle. They promise and promise and promise it will be different this time. Every day they are better this time. He or she is gone. The bottle is gone. Every day you stand with someone else as they draw themselves a turning point in the road as they arrange the signs as best they can to point to anywhere other than over the cliff they are all standing on. They point and they point at the horizon. Dawn, they say. Light, they say. Just look a little harder. Let me slide. Don't call the cops. Give me one more month on the rent. Tell them I'm a good person. Don't let them take my dog. They drag my son right out of the living room. I don't. I can't. Please. Why? Please. The cruelest days. The hardest days are the ones where you say, yes. Yes, I believe you. It will all be better in the morning. I will see you next month for the rent. Yeah.